Calls for LA City Councilman Kevin DeLeon's resignation came from everywhere following the racist recording scandal, from the president to the LA mayor, even his colleagues. Well, DeLeon has refused to quit and is now making regular public appearances. But can he repair his image? KCAL News political reporter Tom Wade is live in downtown LA with what DeLeon's constituents and experts think. Tom? And good evening to you, Pat and Juan. Well, of course, that's a big question, right? Can De Leon repair his image? Just a few months ago, he couldn't go to a city council meeting without being shouted down or essentially even chased out. Contrast that to now, he made a public appearance this week with the mayor. First of all, I want to thank uh, Madam Mayor Karen Bass for her leadership. That's controversial L.A. City Council member Kevin DeLeon on Thursday night praising L.A. Mayor Karen Bass at a hastily called press conference at County USC after three LAPD officers were shot in DeLeon's district. All three survived. Today has been a very busy day for LAPD. Mayor Bass stood apart from DeLeon and did not appear to speak with him. Earlier in the same day, DeLeon appeared at another press conference trying to comfort the family of 17-year-old Xavier Chavarin, a high school student who was stabbed to death a week ago, also in De Leon's district. We have caught the suspect, uh, David Sopeda. De Leon's public appearances in high-profile events are one more sign of his intent to continue his quest to rehabilitate his image. The councilman has also returned to city council chambers for meetings after an extended absence. KDL is not here, thankfully. There were universal calls and protests for De Leon to resign after a racist recording was made public in October, where he and other now former council members were taped making racist jokes and discussing ways to carve up the city's historically black council districts. De Leon has vowed he will not quit. Is it possible for someone to be re redeemed? You know, Steve Francois lives in downtown LA, which is De Leon's district. If you're a servant of the people, then you should reflect the people's values and ideals. Nothing can rehabilitate it. Yeah, he's just, um, he should have resigned with the other people based on the comments that were made. Mayor Bass's office says she maintains her position that De Leon should resign. Political experts say fixing his image will not be easy, if even possible. The old cliche, only time will tell, seems to apply. You just can't erase what he said on that tape. The best thing for Kevin De Leon, I think, is time and other news. Whether or not his constituents want him there, you know, that I think that's up to the voters to decide. We shall see. Certainly there was that LA Times poll. Uh, some weeks ago that showed, you know, not, not many <laughs> had strong support for, for uh, De Leon, uh, but much to be seen in the, in the, coming, in the coming months. Much to be seen indeed. A spokesperson for De Leon says that De Leon is out with his constituents regularly, that they are responding well to him, and he continues to engage them in nightly events. Reporting live in downtown LA, I'm Tom Waite, KCAL News.